In this video, I will explain what a digital assistant is and the benefits it brings to the user experience. A digital assistant is like a concierge bot that combines individual chatbots into a unified user experience. This means that the digital assistant integrates and coordinates the functionalities of multiple chatbots, which we call skills, to offer a more comprehensive and seamless experience to users. Instead of interacting with separate skills for different tasks, users can interact with a single digital assistant that can understand their requests and delegate them appropriately. Chatbots have come a long way since their early days of solving simple business problems, such as customer service automation, automation of structured processes, and self-service. Today's digital assistants are user-oriented and designed to assist users with various tasks. These assistants are context-aware, meaning they can learn about the user and the context of the conversation to provide more personalized and effective assistance. And that is exactly what a digital assistant delivers in the Oracle Digital Assistant platform. Digital assistants intelligently dispatch user messages to individual skills. From a user perspective, the many skills appear as a single chatbot solution. But there are many other benefits, one of which is the fact that a digital assistant brings system intents. These are common intents that we do not need to define in each skill. They handle requests like help, menu, greeting, exit, and unresolved intents. These intents all come with preceded data, which can be extended or replaced with our own utterances. There are some conversational challenges that the digital assistant can handle out of the box. For example, the interruption of a conversation, also called a non sequitur, it is recognized by the digital assistant. If a user message references a skill other than the current one, the conversation is interrupted and continued later so that the user message can be processed by the other skill. It can also handle disambiguation. If a request matches more than a single skill, a dialogue is displayed for the user to choose from. On the Digital Assistant menu page, we can do multiple things. For existing digital assistants, we can create new versions, clone them, publish, export, etc. We can import also a digital assistant, but in this case, we will create one from scratch. By default, there are no skills added. We can see the system intents, exit, help, and unresolved intent. For each one of these, we have the preceded data that we can disable if needed and for which we can add our own training data. We can add skills very easily by just clicking in the checkbox. Once the skills are added to the digital assistant, we still need to train it. Once that is done, we can test it. In the next video, we will cover all the details about conversation routing. Even with one skill, using a digital assistant brings added AI capabilities that can enhance the user experience. As mentioned before, things like the ability to handle interruptions and to automatically disambiguate can be useful if you decide to add more skills in the future. The fact that it has preceded data for menu, exit, and greeting intents can save you time and effort in building these common components from scratch. Also, you may want to add small talk or other supporting skills, which you may want to hide from users. All of that is easily done within the DA. Overall, even with one skill, using a digital assistant can provide a more intelligent and streamlined user experience. Check out our Assistant RT for more information. The link is available in the description.